when snow falls, it's not long before people from all over flock to Fraser Park chasing the winter weather. But when the snow melts away, the mountain community sees significantly less visitors affecting the area's local economy. However, Alyssa Flores has discovered another reason why you may want to head up there for this summer season. Alyssa? Yeah, Tori, no doubt that people are willing to make the drive up the mountain for snowfall, but when the weather warms up, you'll want to see what the forest has to offer too. One local woman is challenging out of towners to explore in the summer season. A little over an hour's drive south of Bakersfield past Fraser Park, the Los Padres National Forest. Beautiful mix of different terrains from the mountains to the badlands. Sharon McBride is with the Mountain Communities Chamber of Commerce. A lover of all things outdoors, she fell in love with the simplicity and serenity of the mountain communities when she first moved here from Orange County a couple of years ago. It's amazing. But she says when the snow melts away, the lack of visitors has a direct impact on the local economy. A lot of people know Mount Pinos and um, this, this part of the hill in general for the snowplay. A lot of people do not realize that this is also an amazing place for summer activities as well. McBride talking about hiking trails that mountain community locals have been exploring for years. Now she's hoping they can help to boost business and attract people from Bakersfield and beyond. When I moved up here, I really wanted to create something for this community to bring more people up on the hill to help benefit the local businesses as well as introduce other regions to this beautiful hidden gem. She hopes to do that through the 3 to one hiking challenge. Three mountain peaks in two counties in one day. Mount Pinos, the highest peak in Kern County. Sawmill Mountain, the highest peak in Ventura County. And Grouse Mountain, because you're practically already there. The views are just amazing in this area. Within two miles, when you go get out and get north of where it starts, it just opens up. And on a clear day from that direction, you can literally see the Sierra Nevadas. So we decided to head up the mountain and take on the trail for ourselves. Perfect weather for hiking. And it's beautiful. Not that many people out here. Which so is we're going to take this challenge on. Along the way, we met plenty of hikers from all over Kern County in the LA area hiking the same trail. Fresh air, blue skies. Who found the hike to be more impressive and less intimidating than they imagined. Even though it's 12 miles and it's a 2,000 foot gain and you're technically bagging three peaks in a row in two counties, it's for people of all experience levels. With the challenge gaining popularity on social Social media. McBride hopes more people will be drawn to discover what the mountain communities have to offer in the so-called off-season. Something that's peaceful, beautiful. I would say people like to come back and, and do it multiple times as a result. And if you do head out, make sure you take plenty of pictures at all three of the summits. We have instructions on our website, turn to 23.com about where you can send those pictures in for a chance to win some giveaway prizes. And Allison, it's certainly going to be a beautiful weekend this Father's Day if you're up for that challenge, right? It is going to be just perfect. I know last weekend was breezy and we're going to be 